Hi everyone, welcome to We Reply, where we reply for stuff. Today, the video on the imaginary chopping block is Film Theory's video, Wally Unseen Cannibalism. Today, we are going to debunk this theory, but first, you need a recap. For those who need 100% of the facts, go check out his video in the top right corner. Okay, done. For those too lazy to move a mouse, here's a massively oversimplified summary. Quote, Earth has become too polluted to sustain life, so a mega company called By and Large sends huge ships to space for five years to house humanity while small Wally robots clean up the Earth. But a series of events lead to the By and Large CEO on Earth to tell the captain and his autopilot that they must never return to Earth, aka Directive A113. Fast forward about 700 years and you reach the current area where the movie takes place. End quote. Okay, got it. Matt Pat and his crew pointed out that there was an obvious shortage of food. They gave evidence to why water and fuel would be a problem. But you can't find food floating on rocks in space after your five-year supplies run out over 700 years. So they concluded that the food has to come from somewhere. And after they analyzed all the fishy bits, they concluded that human flesh was the answer. Since through my own calculations, there would be 3,000 dead bodies per year which is 600,000 deaths or one axioms worth per 200-year lifespan, established in Matt Pat's video. But why are you here? To see me debunk their theory. This is not mocking them, but it's just a video based on it. Mm, disclaimer over. So here's my evidence on why I can debunk the man of game debunkers. Take a look at the calorie stats. In Matt Pat's video, they concluded that every human body is worth 100,000 calories, which is good for 50 modern-day humans on a pure diet of 50 meat. I mean, no, human meat. But only 50 humans? Wow, since there are a whole 600,000 of us over here on the Axiom, which is about 1 13th the sub-hub of game theory, and more subs in this channel will ever get. Hint, hint, click, click. Getting the calorie needs of 600,000 modern-day humans is easy. 600,000 times... 2,000 is 1 billion, 200 million calories per day, or 438 billion calories per year for a full 365-day year. The calorie production for 3,000 deaths per day, starting from the 200th year, is 3,000 times 1,000, or 300 million. But wait, 300 million? That's four times less than the daily need of the axiom. What? That means that that axiom consumes four axioms, annual productions of dead bodies, in a day! So, theory busted, but I can hear you typing with your little gritty fingers. But they are overweight, worth more. So, given the generous estimate that means they produce 600 million calories per year and eat 1 billion, 200 million, which means each person has 200,000 calories per body, but still, that's still twice daily to yearly. Also, overweights need about 2,500 calories per day, 1.5 billion per day which just tips the scale more in my favor and more away from MatPat. Even if they ate the bare survival minimum of 1,300 to 1,500 calories at 780 million calories per day using conservative numbers at 1.5 billion, even won't make the cut. It won't, don't even mention 1.2 billion. So in 700 years, they would have eaten a total of 3.066 quintillion calories. And starting from when they dying, they would produce 150 billion calories, only one over 20,440 times less than eating than production. Also, they don't produce food out of thin air because of the law of conservation of mass. Yada, 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 yada. Also, they would die anyway, since it would be 100 or 200 years before they start dying and creating food. Not to mention that most of the fat in the body are adipose fats, which are very unhealthy. And bodies also yield no fiber or central vitamins and nutrients, mean, meaning everybody on board would be frail, starving, and have scurvy and disease. Not the best, I would say. So, big time, very busted! So, this is the end for our video. So try to think what the axiom is actually eating. Theorize yourself, put your ideas in the comments, and also su suggest what we should respond next. Thanks for watching! Goodbye!